Tonight at UNC Chapel Hill, the party is over. After scenes like these and 135 new COVID cases, a major reversal. The university canceling in-person classes just as the fall semester was getting underway. Massive parties on and off campuses at universities across the country amid a pandemic is the return to college life health officials fear. I feel like it's just kind of inevitable at like any college campus right now just because you have like all these people coming together after being away for so long. With little attention paid to social distancing at Oklahoma State, a sorority is now in quarantine after nearly two dozen students tested positive for the virus. UConn now testing all students living on campus amid a rash of new infections there. Just as tens of thousands of students began classes today. I'm really worried that dozens of my friends, my professors, um, the staff at Elon um, are going to get sick and possibly die. Concern is shared by faculty and parents. She wants the whole experience and I want that for her, but of course I'm just so nervous. With an estimated 40% of colleges nationwide planning some type of return to in-person learning, top doctors are urging officials in hot spots to close bars and shut down gatherings like this one to get COVID under control. Don't be cavalier about getting this virus. Concern over the virus reaching new heights amid new CDC guidance that COVID rates in kids are steadily increasing. In Arizona, a district closed today because teachers refused to staff classrooms. But in Kansas, instructors who quit in one district may be forced to pay up to $10,000 for backing out of their contracts. In Los Angeles, officials announced plans to begin testing all staff, students and their families. Learning from home from now, the results could get students back in the classroom sooner. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.